What's up everybody, welcome to Money Management channel. My name is Andrei and today I'm going to be doing an update on SoFi ticker. And on today's video, first of all, I will show you where we are on a price chart and how we get there. Then I will continue with the fundamental news that might affect the price of this company. And at the end of this video, I will share my thoughts and my technical analysis. And I will show you what should we expect next. So let's start with the price chart. I made my previous video right here at this very point and I've told you that uh, we might have uh, one more leg to the upside and to confirm this movement, to confirm uh, the movement to the top of our fifth wave, we have to break uh, this uh, range, the price point of about $24.64. If uh, we will break it, it will confirm this movement to the upside. Otherwise, we might have uh, some lower price action and this movement will confirm this breakdown. This is our fourth wave and this is the top of our fifth wave. It is a very truncated fifth wave and uh, for now we might have uh, this as our main uh, breakdown, but uh, we have some doubts and I will show you it in my technical analysis. So, as you can see, we hit again the range of this bottom and it might be a very strong support and it is a 0.382 Fibonacci retracement level from the bottom of the third wave to the top of the third wave. But with this movement to the upside, we have to adjust this tool and I will show you how we can do it in uh, my technical analysis. And for now, uh, let's continue with the recent news that drives the price from this point uh, to these levels. And uh, first of all, let's start with the company profile. Social Finance, a finance company, operates an online platform that provides financial services. It offers student loan refinancing, private student loans, personal loans, auto loan refinance, home loans, mortgage loans and investments, as well as insurance products for renters, homeowners, automobiles and others. And for now, this company has a total market cap of $16.6 billion and uh, they have a revenue of $867.87 million with a net losses of $455.54 million. And uh, as you can see, they have very good revenue growth of 89.37%. And uh, they have pretty strong cash position uh, according to this data of $533.52 million. And I have to say, this company is uh, pretty stable and uh, they have a huge potential. And let me show you what was the reason of recent sell-off. First of all, let me show you this uh, news uh, that was uh, published on November 16th and it's titled SoFi Technologies launches 50 million secondary stock offering. And let me quote you these bullets. SoFi Technologies trades 5.1% down pre-market after it announced a secondary offering of 50 million shares of its common stock by entities uh, affiliated with uh, SoftBank, Silver Lake Partners, Qatar Investment Authority, Red Crow Capital and uh, Cha 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 SPAC 5. The company will not receive any proceeds from the sale of uh, the shares of common stock by the selling stockholders. And uh, this news uh, on the first glance uh, might uh, drive for the price uh, of this company down. And I have to say that a lot of people who don't uh, know much uh, about the uh, stock market, their first opinion on this news uh, might be that uh, we, have, uh, we might have a dilution and this dilution uh, definitely might negatively affect the price of the stock. And that's why we have uh, this sell-off. But if you will take a look uh, on their official press release, on their news section, you can find this. The offering consists entirely of shares of common stock of the company to be sold uh, by the selling stockholders and uh, will not uh, change the number of shares of the company's common stock that are outstanding. The company will not receive any proceeds uh, from the sale of the shares of common stock by the selling stockholders. And uh, this exact phrase tells us uh, that the number of uh, shares will remain the same and this uh, means uh, we will not have any dilution related to this uh, stock offering and uh, that's why it is not uh, the fundamental bad news for the company and uh, this uh, sell-off from uh, this uh, point is only a sell-off uh, from weak hands. And let me show you another news that might drive the price uh, south and uh, it was published on November 18th and it's titled SoFi Technologies stock dips after Chamath Palihaptia cuts take by 15%. And uh, let me quote you these bullets. Shares of uh, SoFi Technologies uh, slips as much as 2% in after hours trading after Social Capital CEO Chamath Palihaptia said this week his company sold roughly 15% of its position on SoFi stock. 
The venture capital investor aims to use the proceeds to fund recent investments uh, in technologies that will uh, shape our future, such as uh, Mitrochem, uh, Spectral and Syndica.io, he writes in a tweet. Since Chamath's tweet, Sofi shares have slightly erased losses, now down 1.5%. And why this uh, news might be negative, might uh, consider as a negative. And uh, it's quite uh, obvious because uh, a lot of people think that uh, Chamath uh, is selling his stocks because uh, he don't uh, want to hold the stock anymore because uh, he lose uh, his belief in this company. And it is totally wrong opinion because uh, he sold roughly 15% and this means uh, 85% of position still in SoFi. And uh, on top of that, he has these stocks since uh, the merger and uh, uh, let me remind you that uh, the merger with the Chamath's SPAC Social Capital Head Sophia Holdings 5 was made on June the 1st and uh, he has these stocks uh, from uh, the very beginning of uh, its uh, existence and that's why his average price is extremely low. And even if you enter the position right here on my uh, main call, right here, right below the $14 mark, you might be up uh, to current levels uh, for more than 65%. And uh, it is quite technical and it's quite wise to sell part of your position in order to fix some profits, in order to uh, potentially maybe re-enter in uh, some lower price points if you want to trade these type of assets. And I have to say that uh, it is not uh, the bad uh, fundamental news, it is just a fact that uh, Chamath fixed some of his profits with uh, SoFi. And uh, we have a lot of uh, news uh, that uh, will drive the price of this company even higher. But right after we will have uh, some retracement. And this retracement is happening. But let me show you this. This is the list of uh, bank charter application filed since 2020. And uh, we have a um, bunch of companies. Uh, some of them in the pending list. Some of them in approved list. And uh, on approved list we have uh, SoFi Bank and uh, it's backed by uh, SoFi Technologies Incorporated. And uh, this means this list of uh, these companies is very probable to be approved uh, in near future. And this means uh, it will be a huge catalyst uh, for the price uh, of uh, its shares. And that's why we have to personally wait and uh, accumulate the position on the red days on the market. And uh, let's continue with the technical analysis, but before we dive deep right here, please subscribe to my channel, hit notification bell and hit the like button. This helps me a lot. So guys, we pretty much confirmed uh, this uh, top of our fifth wave. If we will break uh, this previous bottom, so far we didn't break it by just uh, several cents. And if we will break it, this will confirm this uh, breakdown. And uh, in this case, we have to adjust our Fibonacci retracement tool from the very bottom of the first wave to the very top of the fifth wave. And uh, as you can see, we have almost the same levels of uh, potential entry points. And uh, one of them is uh, 0.382 at the price point of $20.34. And we are exactly at this price point. And next one might be at around uh, $19. It is 0.5 retracement level and even the golden pocket. And the golden pocket range is the confluence with this previous swing top and uh, we might have uh, this range as our main accumulation point if the price will hit this range. So what should you do if you want to enter the position on SoFi ticker? You can start to accumulate right here on $20, but you have to keep in mind that uh, we might have uh, some low price action because we have to unload the entire structure from the very top, from the very bottom to the very top. And usually the retracement should be in a shape of simple zigzag. But this uh, might be the first accumulation point that you can enter your position. Next one might be at 0 0.5 at about $19 and next one at about uh, $17.75 range. So when we'll have uh, the trend reversal from one of these levels, I will do another update in order to project some targets. And uh, let me remind you that uh, the bank charter is uh, behind the corner and we have to wait it and it will be a huge catalyst for the company for the long term. And on top of that, on uh, February 2022, we will have uh, a Super Bowl on the SoFi Stadium. This will also be a major catalyst for the majority of people who might be a potential customers of this company. 
So, I think from the technical standpoint that's it for now. If you like my video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel with notification bell. And see you guys and girls next time. Bye!